about our capital, surrounding area and population. So as you can notice, so we are a really small country, but that's good for you as a visitor, because for a very short time, we can explore our touristic attractions. Our exhibition, it's called Blessed by Nature, because we have nature full of diversity and a lot of protected area on such a small place. And that's why we have this light installation in the background. It presents our forests, because more than 70% of our territory is down so this installation is some kind of our tribute to those forests. Oh. And here is a draft wall with some of the most important places in our country to visit. Each uh, leaf has this yellow icon, and when you place your hand on this, then here's information about each of it. First on Arabic, then on English. Olive tree for Europe, more than 2,000 years, and still produces olives. People come under that tree to make a peace because olive is the symbol of peace. Uh, this one stands for our national parks, where we have large reserve forests in Europe, also one of the reasons why we have this right installation in the background. And there are many islands and fortresses on, on this lake. So it's usually going there to visit our household, to try some of our national food, like smoked cat. Then we'll be going to the north. We have some kind of island in the world, Tarapano, which is under UNESCO protection, where you can do many activities like the zip line, rafting, hiking, canyoning. And there is also the highest bridge in Europe, one of the most popular touristic attractions in Montenegro. On the south, we have Lodi's Beach on Adriatic coast, 13 kilometers, which is famous because also you can do many activities like kite surfing, paragliding, sailing, kayaking. It is sandy beach, and sand has pretty characteristic. It's a very close to the as well. We also have another planet for more extreme adventure, Nevidio. Nevidio, in our language, means not seen, because when you get there, you can barely see sky. But as you can see, I want to waterfalls, tunnels, cascades, caves. It has narrow passages through mountains. So it's really beautiful and nice, interesting to visit because of all landscape around. And as a highlight of this wall, we put a declaration on the ecological state. By signing it, Montenegro became first ecological country in the world. So that's why our exhibition is called Blessed by Nature. And each part of this exhibition is inspired by our nature. So all activities from this small and generally all activities that you can do in our country, you can explore in this another top 10, touristic top 10. So it works like this, you place your hand like this, and then you can choose between mountain and seaside. So depending on what you choose, then will appear wide range of activities that you can do in our country. 